Hi, my name is Pippa Goldschmidt and I'm one of the editors of the Uncanny Anthology that's just about to be published by Lunar Press later on this summer. The name of the anthology is Uncanny Bodies and it's a project that was inspired by Sigmund Freud's essay Exploring Concept of the Uncanny that was published just over a hundred years ago. And in it, he sets out how he thinks the uncanny is not the strange, but the familiar become strange. It's our body that might be estranged from us through illness. It's a robot that tries and fails to become human. It's a city that we no longer feel at home in. So we thought it would be really interesting to explore the concept of the uncanny and what it means to us now um, by getting writers and academics to come together and write uh, creative work, literary work, and also academic essays. Some of these academic essays are quite personal in tone and really break down the boundaries of what we think of as academic work. So the project was originally started at uh, Edinburgh University in the Science, Technology and Innovation Studies Unit and it was awarded some funding by Creative Scotland, which we're very grateful for, to pay for the uh, creative work. And the writers that were involved in it include people such as Neil Williamson, Helen Sedgwick, Ruth Aylett, who is not only a poet, but also a professor of robotics at Harriet Watts University. And the academics involved uh, include Jill Haddo and Fadina Mazandarani, who are both lecturers at SPIS at the University of Edinburgh and who are my co-editors in the project. And we're really excited about this project. We think it's a genuinely creative endeavour that breaks down boundaries and will excite people who have uh, read maybe horror and science fiction, but also literary fiction too. And we think it helps to explore what it actually means to be human in the age of machines. So that's Uncanny Bodies, edited by me, Angela Haddo and Fadina Zandrani and published by Lunar Press from August 2020.